In our daily lives, we often neglect our physical and mental health, which could have serious effects as we age. Dr. Chris Swift, an internal medicine physician, says it's a common misconception that declining health and mobility are inevitable with age. Physical activity is essential for the aging process. So these things would include aerobic activities such as walking, biking, or, or, or swimming. Uh, weight lifting or resistance training is also good mm -hmm. even as we age. We know that now. Uh, flexibility exercises such as yoga or stretching and then balance exercises such as Tai Chi also play a role in helping as we age with health. Maintaining mental health should also be a priority for healthy aging as stress, anxiety, and depression could deteriorate health. We have a saying that if you feel down, speak up, uh, that it becomes really, really important to let someone know. Uh, it's important to maintain social relationships that we know that being alone is not good for you from a health standpoint, especially as we age, to find activities that you enjoy it's never too late to learn a new hobby or a new, a new anything new, uh, to do things that stimulate the brain and that also help promote wellness. Another part of staying on top of your health is having regular checkups with your primary care physician and staying on top of your diet. Swift says when you're older, you may not need a large amount of calories, but do need to maintain the amount of nutrients your body needs and a proper diet will help with that. One is the Mediterranean diet, which is just rich in fruits and vegetables and whole grains and lean proteins and in low fats. And then we also have what we call the DASH diet, which is a dietary approach to stopping hypertension. And this is a diet that's low in sodium, and it's actually been shown to lower blood pressure more than any single blood pressure agent. Dr. Swift says it's never too early to start the healthy aging process and recommends starting low with a short walk and increasing as your body allows you to. Karina Bridget, Twin States News, Meridian.